as we come on the air tonight, the coronavirus league in all time highs and hearts in the US. Or they're about the wildfires that have devastated I Australia. This is our time! Hi, I'm Angel Samai. I am a co owner of Overall Murals. Mitri Pankov, co owner of Overall Murals. Ultimately, we wanted to create a mural that could relate to everyone in New York and even the world that would include all the adventures and misadventures of 2020 thus far. So do the right thing is a call to action, basically giving attention to two QR codes that are found on the mural themselves. Um, one is a QR code leading folks to donate and basically buy the bandana that was created alongside the mural and those proceeds went to a nonprofit called Art Start, which basically helps historically marginalized youth get in touch with their creative side and get access to creative programs. Second is a QR code leading to vote.org, so people can learn more about the voting process and register to vote. This is Pedro Yarvide. I'm a Spanish illustrator from Madrid. I'm currently based in the beautiful city of Valencia, Spain. So, um, when they decided to, to include controversial topics uh, like having the police car in flames depicting the riots or the protests against police brutality or having Donald Trump in the mural, I thought, well, uh, there's going to be people that will, will love it, but also there's going to be some people that will think we are making a celebration of riots or violence and in the end it's just a compilation of, of, of real things that have happened this year. I am Anya Karbashian and I'm an artist uh, located in New Jersey but I'm originally from Russia and I did the coloring for this mural. There has to be some, like you have to help the viewer a little bit with the for the colors and like prettiness, you want to make it be like nice to look at, anyways. But at the same time, you want don't want to distract them from um, the meaning of all those like little elements, and you don't want them to be separate. You want them to sort of work together, and that's what I was basically doing. Mic check, mic check! So, here we are! In postmodernistic time, there is no more good or bad, and there's just so many opinions and ideas are gonna appear no matter what you do. So, you gotta do what you think is right for you and be honest to yourself.